Hey, hey guys and girls, it's Stacy here with another episode of Stardew Valley. It's now autumn. Who has... Oh, oh. Wait, do we need that? Why do I feel like we need... A... Oh, why is my inventory full? My gosh, what a start. Just... Throw the boots on the ground. Get those in a minute. Okay, well, yeah, I was going to say, like, welcome back um, from Christmas. I hope everyone had a really good hol holiday period. If you celebrate it or not, whatever you do or did, I hope you had a good time. And, yeah. Let's put these boots where they belong. Let's sort our inventory out. What a mess. How many of these purple mushrooms need to go in the community centre? I'm pretty sure... Is there one that goes in the craft room? Yep. One for the craft room. And... No? Yes. Okay, so two purple mushrooms to the... Yeah, cool. Awesome. Well, I think the first thing we've got to do is get rid of all these dead crops, right? Because, you know, they're dead. And we're going to have to do some hoeing. We're going to have to get our autumn seeds in, our, our fall seeds. And yeah, got to feed our animals as well and milk our cows and so on. Now, because it's been a little while, I actually... Oh, I've got pumpkin seeds. I actually can't remember. Did we upgrade... Oh, I have I have a goat. Did I have a goat before? I probably did. I've completely forgotten where I'm up to. And I'm like, I'm not good at watching myself. I can watch my videos back to edit the recording and that's about it. Like, I just... Yeah. So, do I just have the one goat? Or did I buy two? Who knows? So yeah, I have no idea where we're up to. But, you know, I'm sure we'll figure it out pretty quickly. Like, oh! Oh, it's a duck! Right, cool! And let's get ourselves a bit of hay. That seems to be all the hay we need. I hope the one silo is going to be enough for the animals that I'm going to have for all winter. Because I tend not to buy stuff from Robin. It's a bit of waste of money. Okay. I think I'm going to sort all of this out and plant these pumpkin seeds. And then we're going to go to Pierre and get our winter seeds. Oh, autumn seeds. Alright, I'm like actually out of energy at the moment. Like, legitimately, I am. I have three energy left. This is ridiculous. I think we're going to have to. Hmm. I don't know. I think. I think we'll go to Pierre's. We're gonna have to go to Pierre's and get some seeds. Now, how many do we need? We need one, two, three, four times eight is thirty-two. Plus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight times nine. I'm gonna write this down. I. I will forget this if I don't. Uh, we need four times eight plus eight times nine plus up here is another nine and then we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven spaces cool all right let's go get some seeds and then we'll go up to the you know the um Oh, words. The spa. We'll get some energy back. Oh, and we'll just get this as we're walking past. Thank you. We'll get some energy back and then we'll plant the seeds. So, quiet day today, but, you know, we've got to get our autumn seeds in early. Because, yeah. I kind of want to put more sprinklers in, but... I... yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Topaz, I'll accept it. I probably won't do it. Hey Leah. You only like me too. You would probably like this hazelnut, wouldn't you? But I'm pretty sure I need it. But I'll get one later. Okay, Pierre, my man. Now, I'm already growing corn, eggplant. I want 27 of those. Okay, what else? Uh, cranberry, I want 27. Alright, everything else I'm going to get 
uh, pumpkin. I'm going to get the 32 of those. I've already planted 9, but I'm still going to get 32. I reckon. Is there anything else that is a repeating crop? Just the eggplant and the cranberry? Oh, grape. Oh. Where am I going to put the grapes? Okay, here's what we've decided. So we're going to do a line of eggplants, a line of cranberries. The sprinklers are going to have pumpkins. We've got nine fairy seeds. They're very expensive, so we only have nine of them. We have 27 yam seeds to cover up the remaining nine areas. 27 amaranth for later on. Five grapes and 10 wheat seeds just to fill in any gaps. I think this could work. Oh, and first we need to go to the spa. Okay, first up, the grapes are going to go here. Next, cranberries. Don't mess up, make sure they all go in the right line. Come on. I can just see myself messing this up and like putting one over, you know, there or something and that would just, so that would annoy me for the rest of autumn. It would seriously just trigger me. Okay. Pumpkins mostly in. And now we're going to put fairy seeds. I'll put them here. And I think I've miscalculated. I thought that there was enough for like three of the, yam the yams to go in rather than two. But that's okay. That's fine. We just have a lot of stuff going in. Yeah, definitely do the yams before the amaranth. And then I'm just going to fill in the gaps here with a bit of wheat. There we go. Oh, wrong chest. This chest. Well, okay. We got that all done. Fill up my watering can. Do we actually have much to take to... We've got the mushrooms. and that, That's pretty much all we've got to take over to the placey thing. So there's no point going there. I mean, we could do a quick mines run. The spirits are not very happy today, but who cares? We'll try. I mean, we're actually doing okay. Like, it's nearly 11 o'clock, but we've got an hour to find the exit on this level. We've got a couple of cave carrots that we picked up. Oh, and there's the exit down here. So, like... Yeah. We've just got down five more levels in the mines without even trying. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna hit some rocks and stuff. Get as many geodes and whatever as I can until I run out of energy, which is around about now. Okay. The spirits are super displeased today. They're gonna make my life difficult. Well, you know, what's new really? Ah. We finally, we finally have enough wheat for, we can get rid of those and put in that. I think, I think I only need a 10. Uh, where was it? It was bulletin board. It was the fodder bundle, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So I now have enough for that, which is awesome. Which means I can sell all the rest of the wheat that I make. Let's plant these yams and we'll take our milk pail as well because we're going to need that in a minute. Oh wow, okay, I've just walked in here to pick up stuff. And we've got two pomegranates. I'm pretty sure we needed... Do we need one or do we need two? Uh, we... I know that there's, yeah, one in the enchanter's bundle. I think that's... I think that's actually it. Yeah. Oh my god, if we put that hazelnut in the community chest instead of giving it to Leah. But yeah, we are done, basically. We don't need any more pomegranates. So, that tree can just go and... <laughs> 
I don't know, not grow. Okay, well, we, the wizard wants some topaz. We have, we have a topaz. We can give him some void essence as well. He'll be happy with that. And then, um, we're so close to the bottom of the mines. I'd really like to just go and finish them. So I'm going to grab some food and we're going to do that. He's so rude. Like, I've just given him the thing that he asked for and he's just like, go away. So rude. Anyway, let's go down the mines. Let's get that last five levels. we we'll smash that quest out and it's done. And admittedly, we'll probably need to go down the mines again in the future, but we'll get the key that we need and we'll be done. Oh, hello. I've got some pine tar. That's perfect. I think that was one of the last things I needed for the exotic foraging, actually, other than the purple mushroom, which is already in the chest. So maybe if we get through the mines really quickly, I can grab some stuff and we can finish a few bundles. That'd be a great start to the year. I forgot how displeased the spirits are today. So we're going to have a rough time, I think. But, I don't know, we could be lucky. I've been down here on days when the spirits were displeased and everything just went fine. I think this dude is after me, so let's just get rid of him. Guys, we're so close. We are so close. And I'm just not finding the exit. It's got to be here somewhere. I found so many purple mushrooms though. Like, this is no longer in short supply. We have all of the purple mushrooms you could ever want in your entire life. And yet, where is the exit? I really hope it's down here somewhere. I mean, not like I'm running out of food. Like, as you can see, I still have couple of eggs and I have the blueberries and at very worst I have the purple mushrooms but yeah I also wanted to go to the community center so where is the exit I've cleared all of this is the exit going to be underneath this dude when he dies nope Okay, like, this is gonna- oh, hello. This is going to be the very last rock I break. Oh no, it's not. Almost the very last rock I break. And here we are! We made it! We made it to level 120! We made the bottom of the mines, we've got the skull key! We know what the skull key is for. I mean, maybe, maybe you don't, but I know what the skull key is for. Anyway. Cool. We need to we need to get a new pick and go through there and make friends with the dwarf. Well, I'm gonna walk down Oh! I was about to go to the community center because we have the purple mushroom as well as the pine tar. But here we are. Hello. This is nice. Okay. It does look very lovely, this guy, actually. He, he did that very well. What am I looking at? A planet. It really is. That's so true. Yeah. But... If you had infinite days, how could you value life? Getting philosophical. What up, Maru? Oh, come on. Tell me you like me. Yeah! No, like, for real. I would love that. There's one of the problems of living in a big city is you don't get good stargazing. Like, it's not so bad, but unfortunately there's streetlights in our backyard. And, yeah, so you just can't see the stars very well. We actually got better stargazing in our apartment block because, like, it was kind of a U-shape facing each other and when everyone had gone to bed in the opposite side, like, you couldn't see... It was kind of dark on the ground. 
but yeah. Yeah, I do miss stargazing properly when I was in a smaller city and you could go somewhere with no lights more easily. Maybe that's something I should just do. Go for a drive one day, like three hour drive and take a telescope. That'd be awesome. I reckon I'll do that. Oh! <laughs> All of the things are happening! <laughs> Hi there, Lewis. What on earth are you doing putting up a bulletin board at like 10 o'clock at night? Like, <laughs> really dude? Really? I love Robin. So much sass. <laughs> so good though. Alright. Oh that's good. I'm glad I could help. Oh, that's that's even better. In fact, that matches my ethics in a real life level. Good, 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 good. I like it. Okay, I'll start stockpiling hardwood. There we go. But even if you do sell them in your shop, sorry Robin, I'm gonna get the furniture catalogue. I'm gonna help. That's the attitude. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, so I have played through the scene before on another save. I did not remember that really, really terrible pun. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Why is that so funny? It shouldn't be so funny. <laughs> okay. Whew. Calm down now. I don't know why that's so funny to me. <laughs> I think everyone likes a really good or a really bad pun. Anyway, let's finish off the day with just a little bit of community engagement. We'll finish off that exotic foraging bundle. And then, you know, later on we can worry about the rest of the stuff. So, have a mushroom and have a... where'd it go? Pine tar. Oh, that's nice. That's actually good. I like that. Uh, do I have anything else in my inventory that goes in the community? Oh yeah, while I'm here I may as well put the other purple mushroom in. But nothing else goes anywhere. So that goes in the bulletin board, doesn't it? There we go. So what do I need? I just need a Nautilus, which I think you can only get in winter. Alright, well. I think that's that's pretty much it, guys. I'm going to head back to the farm and put all of this stuff away and go to bed. I don't think anything exciting will happen on the way there, so on that note, I guess this is the end of the episode. So, yeah, once again, hope you all had a good good break and Everybody's not too feeling too dreary getting back into everything. And yeah, I'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye. That was meant to be a wave. Bye.